Okay. The first thing we have is libraries. Just like I told you that most virtually all the all the blogs in the in the scratch, we call it what function what blogs mean that inside that blog you are looking at there are blocks of code. It's only when you put it, it will be executed. Then apart from apart from the standard blocks we know in a, in every programming language, what some people do is that they take the stress to write a lot of functions. You get it now? They take a stress to write a lot of functions such that whenever you are just to ease the application building. So that was what I was telling you that at the time will come that for you to be industrial, industrial relevant, you don't only need to learn the core programming language. You also learn the framework. Listen, listen. You also want learn the word frameworks or the library. So, for instance, now I believe you have done HTML and CSS. Okay, okay not done CSS. <laughs> because if I want to ask you a question. <laughs> okay, and uh, uh, the HTML have a library. No, I don't think HTML have a library. But CSS have a library. We call it Bootstrap. Have you heard of Bootstrap? You've heard of Bootstrap. You are very sure. Okay, Bootstrap is an example of what a library of what CSS. What does it do? They have already compiled several code. Once you place that library, once you place the link in your code, in your any code you are writing, it has a standard documentation. I will still teach you about documentation of it. Every programming language has a standard documentation, like a textbook, where you get everything about it. So what they do, what those guys do is they will create a framework or library relative to a particular language such that you as a developer, you it will ease your development cycles. Do you understand it now? So what you do, what you simply do is just you place those things and then you now call their functions one after the other. For instance, now, if you are designing a website, you must have a navigation bar, isn't it? So that bootstrap now will simply do what they've written a fun several functions on what navigation you are the one that will do what just calling the functions you need then they also have provision for customization so for that's by the way but you understand what this library is then framework and library are almost the same thing the only thing is that framework give you a structured way of programming a structured what way of what programming it gives you a structured way for example now how do I give a, a normal example? Uh, if if you are to come in, so in, inside this place now, huh? if you are to come inside this place, you must pass through this place. Do you get it? So there, just, that's what happens in this place. They structured it that anything you want to do, you must follow a pattern. For example, the framework I normally use most often is called uh, Laravel in PHP. It's a PHP framework. So once you come to that place, there is an MV, MVC program framework such that you more, you cannot write your back you cannot write your back end code inside your front end code. So you must specify everything separately. That's how the framework is. But they also ease it such that I can write some CLI code. It will generate some code automatically for me. So I don't need to start a fresh to start writing it. But we'll still reach there. But just understand that this thing and this thing are the same. The only difference is that this one gives you a structured way you must use to program it, your application. Why this one doesn't give you? You are only just to put, place it and pick the functions already right written inside it and start working on it. You understand the two differences now? You understand the two differences? So, the next one we have is what? API. API. You cannot deal without, you cannot survive in the world of software engineering or programming without apis because what is api it's simply a programmable interface for instance now let me use yango the application called yango we all know yango now eh? uh -huh. you notice that yango can pick your location instantaneously isn't it 
Then it can as well communicate the location of another another person instantaneously. So now do you know what they did? If they had to build the application from scratch, it might take them like 10 years or at least five years to build it. So what do they do now? Most companies, for example, Google now. For example, now Google and every other companies, they have what you call already established APIs. So what you do is that they make it programmable. You understand it? So for example, that I uh, the Google Map, Google Map have an API. So what those young guys did was they simply went and bought the API from Google and placed it in the application. You understand it now? So that is it. I stand with form. Even some most of your weather apps, most things, virtually most everything you are doing is what API oriented. Test your voice to text speech, everything. Most of them are what API oriented. So, but that's by the way. And uh, then we have bugs. We have what? Bugs. Bugs simply means what? Error. You get it now. So we might not, you might end up not call, no longer calling it what error. We call it what box. Any question talks for? Any question talks for? Is there any question? Should I ask? I can ask. All right. Who can uh, who can differentiate between the in your own terms without cramming? Who can differentiate between library and framework? Okay, did I give you an example of a framework? Framework. Okay, there is in in data science, for example, Python now. Have a framework. If you want to use it for, for Python, it's almost every language. You can do almost everything in this world. Do you understand it now? So, so for example, now if you want to develop web applications in Python. You, if you, you use a framework called what? Flux. Yes, Flux. There's another one I've forgotten the name. It starts from the, the Django. Use the Django of Flux. It's an example of framework. Then, if you want to use it for data science, you use NumPy. N U Num N U M P Y and NumPy is a framework. You understand it now? Then, if you want to use PHP, we have Redevel, we have uh, Cake, Cake PHP. Then, if you want to use JavaScript, we have React. We have uh, React, which other framework do you have? We have Next.js. There are so many frameworks. You understand it now. So, but when you keep on growing, the main thing, that's why I keep on insisting. Learn the concept of programming. That is what you need. If you learn the concept very well. Those frameworks have a what? Standard, standard library. What you, anyone you choose, you go and learn the you learn green for my documentation and start practicing before you know it. You can what you can excel. So that being said, that means can we go forward now? So uh we've uh, virtually finished all the function blocks here, yeah? isn't it? So we're able to treat values, and we found out that values related relative to this uh relative to this scratch. Uh, all these uh, values, all these uh, blocks that are what that will just get their value, that will get only values that doesn't function anything. This is, isn't it? Which is they are normally in what in over shape. You, you get it now. So all these ones are what function blocks. Then the next thing we've done very uh, operate operators now. We are through with the whole operators, right? Then operator will not return. We've treated all these operators. Then variables. We treated variables, right? Okay, that means we are relatively done. Relatively done. So we can hide and uh, show variables, right? Then this my blog is an example. This my blog is an example of uh, of creating your own function or creating your own library. So you can. As mean you decided to help people, you can create a lot of, apart from what you already have here, you can create a lot of functions and keep it so that someone can call your functions and start using it. 
So for instance, now, should I, let's just create a function. You can make a function block. You can make a function block. You can name it anything. So let me name it move. I will create it. Do you get it now? So it, it has already created for us. So I can now, on my own, I can now on my own, make, create a, my own function. I can just tell this thing, move, rotate. Move, rotate. Do you understand it now? So that means anytime I call this function, what will happen to this code? Anytime I call this move, it's no longer moving 10 steps. What will it do? It will move and turn. It will go and execute this, this code now. Do you get it? Let's see what happens at this point. So let's try using it now. So, uh, I'm coming. So now, if I want to make use of this block now, I can simply click event. I can simply click event now. Do you get it now? So once I click this event, So I've created a function. Can you see now? Can you see this moving now? Why is this thing moving? Why it's moving is because when I click on this thing, eh? assuming I did not write, okay, let me see. What now? Remember this thing is still moving though. Know? When I click this thing, this, this is the next code to run. When I click on this, when I click on this, this flag now, this is the next code to run, right? Then, the computer will now ask, this thing is a function. Please, what function is this? It will now go and pick this place automatically. I got this now. That's why it start on. So if I change this thing now, the effect of this will change. So if I remove this thing now, what will happen? If I remove what? If I remove this thing now and, and click on flag, what should happen to this code? What will happen? It, it will work. It will not move, right? Because this code, there is dormant. There is nothing to work. Are you getting it now? It will just, it went stagnant. You understand the concept of function now? So, this is, this is it. Then, let's see, let's see an example of a library or a, uh, a library, a concept of library in this now. At the extreme of your code, at the extreme, can you see where you see add, add, add extensions? So there are more other third parties code or blocks people have already formed with Scratch. Apart from the MIT that developed this. So if I click on this now, you can see several. Can you see several? One? For example, now I can create a keyboard with this. I can create a keyboard with it. You see now, once I click, click on this now, it brings another function of this. So, so I can, uh, you want to see? You just click on this now, extension. Then, uh, then we can, we can play keyboard for, with this now. Set piano. Let's try setting piano and see what happens. We can set piano. How many of you are, are music inclined here? Yeah. So if you notice, if I play this now, the more, the more, uh, so if you are changing the number, it's increasing. So I can actually form piano. Do, re, mi, fa, sol, la, si, do. Are you getting it now? So you can actually program your music. You can actually program your music inside this thing now. Are you getting it now? So, are you seeing it now? The other extension, like drawing. If you are the other extension, like what? Drawing. Are you seeing it now? They also test to speech. Can you see test to speech? This test to speech now, if I write anything here, it will say it out. Try it on your own. Try it on your own. Just write any hello, sir. How are you? And play it. You say you just repeat it. Test to speech. I've seen it now. Mm. Okay. Now, 
This is a game I developed. Huh? So let me let me play the game. <laughs> let me play the game. So now what look at the rule of the game. Look at the rule of the game. I'll keep on I'll keep on looking for this with this. This I want to move this now. I can only move with this arrow. I'll keep on looking for this, for this apple to eat it. You understand it now? But if I if I eventually touch this, any of this, any of this red now, it will know it will reduce my, my life. Huh? What? What? Once he touches it, you are eating it. Don't worry. This this the your life in the game will reduce. If you keep on touching it. If you keep on touching this thing, your life will keep on reducing. Once your life is exhausted, it's game over. Huh? Listen now. Oh, listen. Once this thing, once you are touching this, any of this red thing, while trying to eat this apple, huh? your life in the game will keep on diminishing. Diminishing. Meanwhile, if you get this, if you eventually touch, if you eventually touch this now, your your score will keep on what increasing. Are you getting it now? So then, if you reach a particular, if you reach a particular number, you will win the game. But if you couldn't reach the number before your life exhausted, you've lost. Do you understand it now? Let me play it and see what see what I'm saying. Are you seeing? So I will now the apple is appearing at this time. Okay, watch now. Can you see? Let me purposely touch this now. It's reduced. This, this system is low. So I will now start. I will look for it again. Can you see where is it now? I have to start going there before it disappears. It has disappeared. I'll keep on looking for it. My life has reduced again. I will go again. I've eaten it. <laughs> Look at my life. My life has exhausted. Do you get it now? My life has exhausted. So now, if I see play it, if I see play it instantaneously, without touching my life, it will definitely win. <laughs> So now I want you guys to program this thing to be more better. Hey, you can now. You can honestly. You can. You can. You can. It's simple. Okay, I'll give you hint. I'll give you hint. I'll give you hint. At least listen what you are going to do now. See what you're going to do. Pick your sprite. Make sure each of them can move according to the arrow. Just like if I press right arrow to move. Everybody can do that. Right, let's do it. Let's do it. Let's do it. Let's do it. Sharp, sharp. After that now, like we'll be doing it one after the other. So why why is not responsive? I know why it's not responsive. Because it's not because it's not, there's no data. It's the way I programmed it. The program will only run when the arrow is is uh, is being clicked, all right. Uh, let me quickly run run it through my uncle. Then we we'll call it a day. Uh, huh? let, let, let me run it through my code. First of all, if I start this game now. If I, oh, you if I click on flag to start the game, when I click on this flag to start this game now, eh, everything will be set to zero. The score will set to zero. This one will start from this. Your life will be few, which is all the right. So that is it. Then whenever it touches it, whenever this thing touches, this score will fail. So let, let's see. First of all, you understand how I did that flag now? The flag of the team. Then, let me go to my code and see. First of all, this flag now. What happens at this flag? 
When is Sprite to sleep now? Eh? When is Sprite to sleep? He switches this background. Are you seeing it now? He switches the background. He switches to this background and I've already drawn it. You know, everybody now has to customize this now. You know how to customize all these things. Yeah, yes, yeah. So it's to the background. It will hide. It will broadcast. It will what? Broadcast. It will broadcast. It will broadcast, it will broadcast right? Then it will broadcast uh, uh, an event called start. Then let's receive this, let's receive this event from this place. This arrow. You we'll receive the event from here. I can not see it. Are you seeing it now? So whenever I click this now, I'll trigger this event. I'll trigger this. I'll trigger this now. Then first of all, I will set I will set this into 100. Set it to what? Set my uh, my score to zero. I'll set my life to zero. Then. I've said this thing now. Is it true? Yeah, yeah. Hey. 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 The next thing is that I will look. I will look the whole of this. I'll look the whole of this, which is go to. 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 Wait five minutes. To wait for five minutes. Five before the next five seconds. Before the next code will be What is the next code? It will not change. If if this this app is not in display, I get it now. If it's not in display, it will update. Listen, it will what? Update the change. It will update it that that is changing it. Changing this state variables now. By what? What will it change it by five minutes? If you change it by five, I can see now. Five is not me. Okay. I just said it's not easy. So it's a little bit less. Make click click here now. Timmy, cut all the time. Even though it's more attacking. Okay, October. So now, so what? See what I will do? Oh, you don't know. So what I will do? Calm down. For instance, to be. That for for the apple to eat it, that is 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 Remember, if it if else, if this one does not work, this one will work automatically. Yes, yes. But this one is exclusive. This one will work. If this code does not perfect, if this one, if this is not being us true, if this one is not true, you just keep it and come to this place. If it's not true, you skip it and come to this place. If it's not true, you skip it. Then yeah, it's not. That's what, what it will come to, isn't it? So this one is now will work. Then, I want to ask the computer if the score, if you want to change the computer, you want to continue, if you want to change, if the score up to 50, that score that is being updated, you see up to 50, you want to change the score, then what is the next step? Then, 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 what is the next step? So what should we do for me? Whatever this is, if you switch a background, I already get the background. Yeah, right in the way. You get it, you can't switch the background. Switch background to this thing. Now display the green. Do you get it now? If remember if the score is off this and end the program. Sir. I get it. Display the background. The score and the light. Everything you said. You should be in the next background or you don't need, you don't need it. No, you don't need it. Then you can still go forward. Then apart from that, I still went to S. King. And that's how the program works. King. Work. Then let me go to this flag. I think the, the next one is this. King. So, look at that. Can you see that?
said I use the function. So I see. What is that? Look at that. Have you noticed that I use a, a, a function block? I created my own function. Oh, I remember my love, my love, my love. Two more. See me, see me. I'm falling in a mukba.